Nice undercut bank. Put a little piece of worm on there. I can't resist. Oh, lands perfectly in there. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, he's still on. He's still on. Oh, it's a nice one. Oh, it's a nice one. <laughs> Look at him jumping. <laughs> he's a jumper. Oh, he's a jumper. Welcome back to our channel guys. Maggie and I are out for a fun day today. We're in uh, Michigan's Upper Peninsula. We're gonna do a little brook trout fishing. We're just gonna hike up a river and do a little catch and cook too. Yeah, so right now we're looking for some wild raspberries and blueberries and we're hoping to pick some and maybe eat them with our fish later. We'll see. It's gonna be a great day. We're gonna go do a little bushwhacking and hike up this stream then just walk the stream back down to where our cars park. So we're really excited. We hope you enjoy the video and stay tuned. So it's end of July right now and this is just peak time for wild blueberries and raspberries here in the Upper Peninsula and I've been finding a bunch of them here. Just they're not, you know, they're not as big as what you typically see in the store but boy they're delicious. Oh my god. <laughs> they're so good. This is like my favorite thing all growing up. They're so good there's just no comparison but I better quit eating these because we're going to need them for our lunch. <laughs> Well guys, we just got some blueberries and raspberries picked for our lunch, so now we just need to go catch some brook trout and finish it out, and then we'll probably cook them up right on the river and show you guys how we like to cook them, and yeah, this will be a nice sweet treat to have with our fish. Okay guys, well we just got to the river here. We just parked on the side of the road, and we're gonna hike up river a ways, do a little bushwhacking, and uh, make a trail, and just walk the river back down. So we got two poles, got our backpacks full of gear, got our cooking stuff, let's go have a fun day. Oh, this is the real deal here. This is what makes the adventure, this is what makes it worth it. It's getting back into a, putting the work in, getting back into a special piece of water, go through the tunnels. Oh. All right. 
right, guys. See a river up here, though. The end is in sight. Let's get underneath this big tree here. I think we didn't have all this gear. Make it a little easier, but look at this, guys. A little hole, a little opening. A little beaver slide. I'm gonna come down the beaver slide. Into the river we go. Take our time. Might be a little deep right off this bank here, honey. Okay. Oh yeah, what a beautiful little river. Woo, does that feel good? Woo -hoo. That's a trout stream there, baby. That's a trout stream there. You know it's a special little river when you hop into it and it takes your breath away and it's 85 degrees in the middle of July, but take a look at this, guys. This is just a gorgeous little river here. Wow. Just a gorgeous little stream. All right, time to find out if it's worth a crap, eh? Yeah. <laughs> we'll see. I think so. Okay, guys, so all we're using today is just an ultralight rod. We got this one at Bass Pro Shops. It's just their micro light rod. And then we have six pound test on here and a size six Raven specialist hook. And then about two, three feet above that, we have our split shot. So we're gonna be using some crawlers today to try and catch these brook trout, but we're also gonna try throwing some spinners and Rapalas just to see. Um, and our plan is, is just to hike all the way back down this stream. We're hoping to catch a couple, maybe, I don't know, five, six of them, cook them up down at the end of the stream. We brought some peppers and onions and stuff. And then obviously we have those berries too that we picked earlier. So it should be a fun day. We're hoping to catch some fish. We haven't been on this stream before, but we've, brook trout fish before so we're excited to try out something new and we just hope it's worth it that we just hiked through <laughs> the jungle to get to here but I'm sure it will be and should be a good day oh that's a juicy one holy moly are you putting the whole thing on there dang oh man Nice, Max. Feisty. Pretty little brookie. So guys, the thing we like to always do with these brookies here is just get our hands wet when we handle them. These are nice wild trout here, so especially the ones we're gonna release, get our hands wet. Got him, got him. Oh, what a pretty brookie. Oh man, look how pretty that is, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, what a beautiful little brookie. Oh, what a beautiful little brookie. All right, guys, well, our first hole just landed this beautiful little brookie here. So pretty, just a nice wild brookie. That'll be a good one for the catch and cook, hey? For sure. Yeah. Great start to the day. There he is. I saw that get bit from here.
Well guys, we have what we want to eat here, so Kyle's going to go ahead and clean them. And I'm going to cut up some onion and peppers and we're going to fry them up in some butter. Should be really good. Okay guys, so we're going to get our chow ready for our catching cook here. And we're just going to cut the head off and gut these. You could actually leave the head on if you want, but we're just going to take the head off and gut them. And uh, we're going to score the sides of the meat. I'm going to show you how to do that. So we're just going to come right behind the fin there. Give that a cut. Scissors actually works pretty well with this too, a nice sharp pair of scissors, but then we're going to cut all the way up to the butt there And we're just going to take all these guts out And we're going to uh, go rinse them off down in the water here So we're going to do these for all four of our trout, but another little thing here we're going to do Is we're going to kind of score the side of the meat here So we're just going to cut down right to about the backbone Just about an inch or two apart that way, you know the butter and all the seasonings can get in there Get in there on the meat of these trout and turns out really nice. It's really good. That's perfect. Look at that nice orange meat there. These are my, some of my, probably my favorite eating trout there are. Okay guys, well we just had a great dinner out here. It was gonna be our lunch, but we stayed a little longer than we thought. It's just been an awesome day out here on this river, just exploring, doing some bushwhacking. We've just been wading the river. It's been so much fun. Caught a bunch of brook trout. We just had our dinner. Those wild blueberries and those wild raspberries went so good with those brook trout. It was awesome. So we're just gonna walk down the rest of the stretch of river. It's getting cloudy now. It sun's going down later in the evening. So we're gonna see if we can't find a few more nice brookies. So stay tuned and let's go head down the river. Okay guys, we're gonna give a spinner a shot here. We caught a bunch of them on worms today. So we're gonna give this little panther martin a shot. Maggie picked this out yesterday. On our way up here, we're going to put a little split shot above them. We're just going to roll this thing through. See if we can't get a uh, bigger trout on this spinner. Let's give it a try. Oh, that looks so nice. Mags, it looks so nice. Just that little gold blade, black body. Oh, I'm liking it. I'm liking it. Keep moving. Yeah. It's getting cold. Okay. Oh, fish on. Oh, I had him on the spinner. Dude. Oh, there he goes. Ah! <laughs> Look at that. I'm here trying to catch a big fish on a spinner. And that's the smallest one we've caught yet. Come here, little guy. Oh, dude. I just want to see like a hog. Come on. Oh, right up in the book. Oh, did you see that? That was sick! That was, awesome. that was sick! That was awesome. Oh, that was so sick! Yeah. <laughs> that was awesome! <laughs> oh, did you see that? Oh! Nice, Mags! It's a good one. Come on. Oh, that's a nice one. That was awesome. That was so cool. That was so cool. Saw him come out and grab it. Not a monster, but just a beautiful, another beautiful brookie. Jeez, oh, Pete. Whoa. Might have a leaf on my spinner. You do have a leaf on there. Oh my gosh, Max, look at this. Oh, swinging right in this little cut. There's gotta be something in there. Oh my gosh, how not? Oh, oh, got him. Got him. Oh, it's just a little rascal, but I got him. <laughs> 
Oh, got one on the spinner. Got one on Maggie's spinner. This is a little guy, but Maggie's spinner. Nice. Nice. Send him home. guys we hope you enjoyed our video we had a great day out on the water exploring this new stream and chasing after some brook trout and if you like this adventure style video please drop a comment and let us know we love getting out there and filming them and we're gonna have a bunch more coming out so if you haven't already please subscribe to our channel and like our videos because it's gonna help these videos get out there to more anglers like you and we're gonna be able to keep doing them so we really appreciate it and we'll see you back here in a couple weeks in our next video